Hello, my name is Leanne and welcome to the first vlog of 2020. Well, it's January 1st, it's already almost 6 p.m. Yeah, we celebrated New Year's at home. There were just two of us. We went out at midnight, watched some fireworks and had some champagne. And then, yeah, we started New Year's with watching a movie. We started The Hobbit, The Unexpected Journey. I think the first one is. I haven't watched The Hobbit, so yeah, we decided to watch that one. But I didn't finish it, I fell asleep. Because we started at like 1 a.m. or something like that. So yeah, I fell asleep, so I finished it today. My boyfriend had to work today. Then I'm um, the first book I'm reading this year is Ruin and Rising by Lee Bardugo. It's on my Kindle. Because that's the book I didn't finish last year. I started last year and didn't finish it. So I decided that I'm gonna finish that one first before I get to my January TBR. Technically this is on a January TBR, but I had an idea, like a team TBR, and I'm not gonna start that one before I finish this one. Hello. Just got home from work. It's Thursday, January 2nd, and... <clears throat> okay, first, one weird thing that I... I know I have that... I do that, but today it happened, so I decided to tell you. Well... While I walked home, it's dark, there are street lights on, and whenever street lights flicker or like just turn off or die, or whatever reason they are not on, the first thing that comes in mind is Dementors. It's weird, right? Yeah. That's the first thing. Every time the street lights flicker or turn off when they supposed to be on, the mentors. Yeah, that's the thing I wanted to tell you. And then we bought something on thirty first, and we haven't built it yet. I kind of want to try to build it. By myself but I'm not sure I can I probably can but should I do it should I build my Billy okay I will try to decide what to do we'll see if I build it myself or not but yeah I just got home I'm gonna have some food watch some booktube and then continue reading Ruin and Rising. I got to, I don't know which chapter last night before I went to bed. Let's see what it shows me. I'm on chapter 8. That's like 38% in. I think I've done pretty well. We lost a bug. Oh no, here it is.
It's Friday! Can you see what I did? I built the shelf. But the hardest part really is reorganizing the books and deciding what goes there. Currently, I put my unread books in Latvian. There. Those are not all because I think I have... I know that I have here few more and I have some at my old apartment, family apartment. So, I don't know. I don't know what to do with the books. Maybe I should put all the English, unread English books there and see how much space it takes up on that shelf because they are like I feel like most of the unread books are in English not I feel I know that most of the are in English I can update you a little bit more about reorganizing my books so right now there are my unread books in English then on top are red books in English and red books in Latvian. Then here too are my kind of Harry Potter shelves. Then are unread books in Latvian in those three things. Here is a mess and down here is a mix of Latvian and English books and a mix of red and unread. It's just a mess. I just put everything there so it's not empty. Here I have a cat. Zena. She's busy. Good morning. It's Saturday morning. And I kind of want to film a few videos. But I feel a bit sick. I have like, I don't know a cold or something so I don't know I have a stuffy nose I can't really breathe properly through the nose so yeah I don't know what did I do this morning I read a chapter of Ruin and Rising then I have been spending like past hour and a half two hours watching booktube videos I just filmed three videos. Yes. They're not gonna be a long ones. Maybe the last one, my December wrap up, because I rambled. I don't know about what sometimes, but considering I didn't read that much in December. But yeah, I'm done with three. I have one to film, but I don't know if I'm gonna do that today. Because since I don't really have, like, to sit like this, it's gonna be my journal flip, flip through of this thing. There's not just, like, last year. I started this one a long time ago. Then you, when I flip through it, you're gonna see how it started and how it ended. But yeah, I just want to do that because I find it interesting and I love how big it got so I still have to film that one like the journal flip through but yeah now I don't know what I'm gonna do I drink, drank my tea I drank my C vitamin drink because I don't feel too well and now I don't know what to do Maybe I should read for about half an hour before I do anything else. So, I first need to take off my lip lipstick because I'm pretty sure I'm gonna forget that I have it. And I'm gonna smudge it all over my face. Because it's so dark. I'm starting to feel like I'm gonna have a headache. But not a migraine headache. Like 
cold type of a headache. But who knows, it can turn into a migraine. Because I have those. Oh, jeez. Kitty. Where did you go? Here is my kitty. She just stepped on the scales this morning. And I saw how, like, heavy she is. She's almost 6 kilos, like 5.8 kilos. That's I'm a lot. She's a big kitty. Hello. <laughs> oh my god. I wanted to update you, but I'm sick. Kinda. I don't have a temperature in it or anything. I'm just full of snot. <laughs> I have a bit of a headache, but yeah. But that's not what I wanted to say. I finished Ruin and Rising yesterday, and I actually really liked it. I kind of was disappointed by the ending. I would have liked it differently, different, but yeah. I'm so glad I'm finally finished with the Shadow and Bone or the Grisha Trilogy or however you call it, because I started it uh, on December 2018. I think I read the first book and then in August last year I read the second one and now I started the third book in December but finished just now. So I'm so glad I'm done with that book. But I started a new one. I started this one. If you saw my, I don't know, when. I think I've mentioned it in my TBR and in my 20... No, that wasn't it. By the way, I feel like I mentioned it in more than just one video. I'm not sure. But I started this one and I said... I thought it was uh, like a crime or something like that. But actually, it's not. It's like a contemporary kind of. But it's old. It's published in 1977. So, it's a Latvian author, but Latvia in 1977 was in Soviet Union. So, the literature is heavily not inspired, but influenced because there were strict rules, there were things you couldn't write because if you wanted your book published, you just had to like write what the government thought is right. And if that got accepted and was allowed to publish, then okay. And I feel like this is going to be a nightmare because... It's set in Riga, in the city I live, but the street names are not all, but some are different because, yeah, the main street wasn't called like it what it is now. It was a, had a different name, but that's not it. It's about two. It's not a crime. Firstly, it's about two young. Teenagers, I th the girl is 19, but the boy, I don't know if, if he's 19 or 20, but young adults. And they are freshly out of high school. They got married like a couple of months ago from the where the book starts. And the girl's looking for the job and the boy has started university. And I just don't like the boy, how he's talking to the girl and how he 
thinks about the girl because he makes her less like valuable i don't know if that's the right thing but like he's higher because he's a man not a woman and i just hate how he talks to her and thinks about her it's just so annoying she is naive but she is only 19 <clears throat> she's just out of school and she from what i got she doesn't think too high of herself to get into a university institute college whatever in that times there were so she finds a job they live with the boys mother and grandmother they're sharing the apartment because they can't afford an apartment by themselves. And they even share a room with the grandmother. They have this big, like, what? How do you call this furniture thing? Like this big thing in the middle of the room to divide it in two so they can kind of live a bit separately from the grandmother and yeah I just I'm two chapters in I'm on page 68 it's a small book but it has like 319 pages so it's quite a long one but yeah I'm I'm gonna see I'm gonna read a little bit more and see how I feel maybe I'm I don't know if I want to continue reading it and finish it. I don't like DNFing, DNFing books, but maybe I should start doing that. But we'll see what happens. Yeah, I'm not a fan of this one right now. So I took a break. I read the chapter, the chapter two. They're quite long. If you consider I'm on page 68 and it's only chapter three. And they're from both of their points of view. The first one from the was from the girls, the second one's from the boys, and now it's the girl again. So yeah. But I took a break. I'm just dying slowly. Dying. Because of the sickness. My nose is running and I just oh, it's so annoying. I was sitting here writing in my reading journal with pieces of tissue in my nose so it's just doesn't so it doesn't get doesn't drop on my journal because when I like bend my hand down it just gets worse I don't know but yeah I'm adding some spreads in my reading journal I found this uh, wizarding world tour reading challenge I saw it on Twitter. Olivia reads a latte, like posted a tweet uh, uh, with her spreads, and I saw it and I just, I loved it, and I think I liked it. Then I retweeted the tweet, and then I thought, okay, I just can't stop thinking about it, so I need to make a spread of my own. So that's what I'm doing now. We'll see how it ends. I don't write, like my handwriting, but it's going to be fine. I need to practice some nice fonts because I don't know how to write them. But yeah, I have added my 2020 goals because I didn't think about leaving like few pages at the beginning. So they are going into January, but that's okay. I added the goals page. I decided to add books to buy because I have, I don't have a big list right now, like on this little post-it, like it's full, but few books that I want to get. So I'm gonna write them in the journal on that page too. So yeah, now I'm gonna finish the Wizarding World Reading Challenge and continue watching some booktube. Just a quick update before I end the vlog. I read one more chapter and I still don't like the book, of course. I just hate 
the boy in the story, boy, man, doesn't really matter. He's an idiot. I just don't like it, him. He's selfish and just... <sighs> he annoys me. The way he treats her wife. He treats his wife. Apparently I don't know the pronouns or what they are. But yeah. So, I don't know if I'm gonna continue with the book. I just don't know. I have a problem with DNFing, so... I don't know <laughs> what I'm gonna do. But I'm gonna end the vlog here. I need to edit it. For, I don't know when it's gonna go up. Tuesday? No. Monday, Tuesday. Yeah, Tuesday probably. And I think I need some sleep because I don't feel good. And... <clears throat> yeah. So, it's gonna be it for this vlog. And I'll see you in the next one. Bye.